Yo guys, it's Corrales and welcome back everybody to the Minecraft Inspiration series, which is still the series for you guys to get some inspiration what to build in Minecraft or maybe even how to build in Minecraft. The place for today just in front of us. It's modern, it's amazing, it's on a beach. Let's call it a modern beach house. It's even got a boat. Look at the boat. It's got a boat here. We can just drive in your car or bicycle or wheelchair or whatnot. It works. And I'm actually standing on a, a helipad. So the scenery here is beautiful. Check the corners in the description, get your butts here and check it out yourselves, all right? But first, who made you a beautiful place? It is a big modern house made by Boba Lord. I love that name, Boba Lord. I'm gonna hug the sign. Check me out on YouTube and Twitch. So I guess that's gonna be Boba Lord there as well. So if you do enjoy this project, everybody, do check out Boba Lord. <laughs> I love it. Sorry, buddy. I kind of love the nickname, all right? Or right, IGN. Boba Lord. Uh, so thank you so much for building this place. And where do we start? Let's take a spin around this. We got something building there in the sky. It ain't a diamond in the sky, that's for sure. But I think it might be a boat or something being being constructed. If we just go here around us and check it out, we got an amazing back garden. I didn't expect that to happen, to be honest. Got a little soccer field for the kitties. I would love to have something like this when I was younger, you know, in my back garden, it would be pretty amazing. We got a swimming pool with this little cool wall dividing it. I normally use that material for like driveways and stuff, like combination of those materials, but it works so amazing as a kind of wall divider from the ugly dirt behind it. And then we got a little balcony overlooking a swimming pool. That's kind of neat, but where are you going, balcony? It goes around and then down to the thing. Oh, this cave was naturally caved that I modified. Hike to the cave. Cave, amazing. What has he used? Oh, that is clay. I love his color combination. And this is something which is really neat as well. This is just cobblestone stairs and cobblestone blocks. And usually we just see stone, but cobblestone works perfectly fine if you choose a combination of like snow or white stained clay. Or even, I think that's grey or black. Works. It's pretty, pretty amazing. But you know what? I'm not gonna keep you longer. I'm gonna go inside here. And what is you? You is a bedroom, no door? Scary! But then again, I think he kinda lives here by, him, by himself. So there's no neighbors around. So don't worry about that. We don't have to have doors, I guess. And this is really neat. Alright, this is really cool. Because... I like when people do the little dividers back back here. Look at that. I mean, he could just place the bed on the wall and it would be perfectly fine. But if we just add a little small thing here, this is gravel. And look at it. I mean, it works perfectly fine. And then he kind of put some some court slabs in with the snow caps just to give it some extra feel. And then we got a little laptop area. Oh, and the player heads are back. I'm going to hug you because I like you. Thank you so much for being back. So everybody, for a simple, modern, sleek bedroom. This is design. It works. And on this side, we got what? Hanging your clothes. We got a cool little TV room. And as well, some snow caps. Huh. Oh, I. You, this is inspiration, all right? I mean, it's so freaking simple. You just put a fence pole, a quartz pillar, and then it becomes a lamp. I know it doesn't really emit any light itself, but it looks amazing. Now doesn't it? I mean, how has he done this? This is some window penises, some snow caps, some doors, and then just carpet. And then it becomes a really sleek looking table. Inspiration? Screenshot, thank you. Now if we head on here, this is gonna be the kitchen, right? Yeah, it is a kitchen. Look how clean it is. This is really awesome, all right? So we get the little hoof, the little whoop, air thingy I'll take, and then we got some some stained glass, and behind that we got some furnaces. And if we check here, it looks like a realistic like little oven or something. So just for inspiration, everybody, just for inspiration, then we get a sink area here with those lamps. And this is also some inspiration. There's a bunch of inspiration in this house. If you have like snow melting disabled on your server, right? And if you build with using like, I think he used glowstone, I'm not really totally sure. But in there, there's some glowstone, all right? And then you just lower the snow caps a titty titty bit. And that creates a little edge around this place here, which kind of emits some light. And it looks freaking bananas. So, Boba Lord, thank you so, so much. And I'm heading, see, 
use the same effect here. It's got some some stuff here back, which can emit some light, so we can have some light up here above the TV. Ha! It's kind of like a backlit TV, like there's you know those Philips TVs, which kind of got a little backlit as soon as the picture changes, the color changes. Kind of cool, I guess. Up here we got a, a bedroom, which is kind of mirrored from the from below. It's nothing else besides the color change, I guess. And then we have this cool balcony going around the place. This is, by the way, if you're building in creative using the Flow HD Texture Pack, all right? The material I'm standing is actually, I think it's bedrock, but it looks so amazing in this shader pack. Or it is resource pack, sorry. Damn, this is a amazing little place. Would I say it's big? Maybe not humongous. But it's a really nice looking place. I kind of love how he divided that. Like that we got a little bedroom here, bedroom there, the kitchen, living room and dining room. And up here we have a TV room. Then we got a secret thing over here. Oh, it's a little bathroom for your like imaginary dump needs. And I kind of like that it's black because it kind of gives us a more, I don't know, modern feel to the place. Hello, shower. Hello. And then, final thing on this side, maybe, I don't know. Damn, I love it. I love how clean it is. It's kind of like, it's totally empty, but it's still like livable. So we got the bed design here and behind here. This is awesome. He could have placed the bed up here on the f far wall, but no. He said, all right, this room is pretty big. How will I divide it? And then he just used a little divider here and it can still squeeze in stuff behind it. Mm-hmm. Inspiration? I think so. Balcony in the front with some green bushes. Pretty, pretty nice and sleek. Overlooking the bay and the yacht, which we're gonna take a peek on. Oh no, baby K's awake. Guys, be right back. Sorry, I'm back. You know, the little poor guy, he's got like ear infection on both his ears and he's so sad and there's nothing we can do and he can't really communicate, but he's being strong, so don't worry about it. But I like the view here, by the way. So every time he cries, I'm gonna go up and check on him just, just in case, you know, just wife he needs help or something. Then we got two balconies. Okay, so we got one balcony on the front and then we got a bal back balcony here overlooking the little football field over here, the swimming pool and the little balcony. I mean, there's a bunch of inspiration and ideas from this. Just, for example, the little bush things here, the bush dividers. I mean, just use some weed, a wheat, some bushes, some flowers, some pods all, and that becomes that. It works, it looks very, very, very nice. Is there anything else? How do you emit light so nicely? I don't want to break you, but that looks gorgeous, I would say. TV room. I think we've seen most of the house itself. So everybody, hope you guys got some inspiration. We even got a little front pool, which I didn't notice before. Damn! Two pools for the win! And then back to the yacht. Yacht, here we come. So let me see here. Made by Boba Lord. <laughs> YouTube Twitch. Boba Lord. <laughs> Love it. Thank you so much. With a little car. A little sports car. Little sitting areas, I guess. This is like super, super modern yacht, I guess. It's gonna be a pain turning that car and squeezing through this entrance, buddy. But I wish you the best of luck, alright? This is f actually four blocks in width. You should be fine, alright? Just, just the turning radius might be a bit horrible, I guess. Hello. No way! <laughs> we even got a little secret bedroom in here. Look at this. That's awesome! I mean, this, when you come in here, it is pretty dark and scary, but then we got that. Damn, this is awesome! It looks so freaking modern. And then how you walk in here. So this is where the captain sits. Well, using the shader, I hope the captain doesn't use shaders mod, because then he won't be able to see anything outside the windows. But I don't think he does now, does he? Boba Lord, I ain't gonna lie. This is a nice little yacht you got going here. And the house is pretty amazing. And then I can see... Is that Boba Lord's next project, you guys think? Something is being created here, you know what? Just a little sneak peek. OMGs. Is that Boba Lord as well? Let me just check the signs. Comment wall. 
No, 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 no. This might be in a, in another episode, okay, guys. But if you come on the server, there's an amazing place just around the corner from Baba. I just want to say Baba Fat, but it's not. It's Baba Lord, all right. Uh, there's an amazing place over there as well, and, and another yacht as well. So, not gonna say anymore. Thank you so so much for watching. But I, I, I'm, I, I am saying more now. Am I? Yes, I am, guys. Leave some nice feedback for Boba Lord in the comment section if you did enjoy this house and if you got some inspiration from it. Hopefully you guys did that. I like this. I like that. That they kind of divide the house. Although, this is so world edited, so it's going to be really hard to, to kind of reproduce maybe. Or maybe that is a full block of snow and then just a little gap. I'm not sure, guys. Not sure how that works, but I think it's related. But I love how it's divided. So I'm just gonna take a screenshot for the little thumbnail about here. Thank you so so much for watching, everybody. As I said, don't forget to leave some nice feedback for Boba Lord in the comment section, and don't forget to come and like and favorite the video if you did enjoy. I'm out of here. Diamonds in the sky? No. Diamonds and love. That's right. And potato heart. Love to bits. See you guys in the next one. Thank you and bye bye. Better, 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 better